We're diving into the fascinating world of numismatics with a rare find that could change your perspective on pocket change forever. We're talking about the elusive 1964 Lincoln penny without a mint mark, rumored to be worth millions of dollars. Behold, the 1964 Lincoln penny. But this one's special, it has no mint mark. Minted in Philadelphia, these coins were accidentally struck without the D or S mint mark. This particular variant of the 1964 penny is exceptionally rare. Only a few are known to exist, making it a holy grail for collectors worldwide. In the early 1960s, the Philadelphia Mint inadvertently produced a small batch of pennies without their distinguishing mint marks. Today, these coins are sought after by collectors and investors alike, with some fetching prices well into the millions. Finding one of these in your pocket change would be the ultimate jackpot. They represent a piece of history and a rare glimpse into the quirks of minting errors. So, the next time you receive a handful of pennies, keep your eyes peeled for the 1964 penny without a mint mark. It might just be your ticket to a numismatic fortune. This coin value in market $1.1 million. Thank you for joining us on this journey through numismatic history. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more intriguing tales from the world of coins. We're diving into the world of rare coins with an extraordinary find, the 1964 D. Mint Mark Lincoln Penny, rumored to be worth millions of dollars. Check this out, a 1964 Lincoln Penny with the D. Mint Mark. Minted in Denver, these coins are incredibly scarce and highly coveted among collectors. The 1964 D. Penny is a numismatic marvel. Due to a limited mintage and historical quirks, it has become one of the most sought-after coins in the world. In 1964, the Denver Mint produced a small batch of pennies marked with a D that has since become a legend in the world of coin collecting. Today, these coins fetch astonishing prices at auctions and private sales, with some specimens valued at millions of dollars. Owning a 1964 D penny is like holding a piece of history. Its rarity and the story behind it make it a prized possession for any serious collector. This coin's value in market $1.40 million. Imagine stumbling upon one of these in your change. It could be life-changing. The hunt for this elusive treasure continues to captivate collectors worldwide. Thank you for joining us on this thrilling journey through numismatic history. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more fascinating stories from the world of coins. We're exploring a coin that might just make you a millionaire, the 1970D Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Yes, you heard that right. Some 1970D pennies are worth far more than their face value. But what makes this humble penny so special? Let's find out. First, let's talk about the basics. The 1970D penny was minted in Denver which is indicated by the D mint mark right here below the date. Millions of these pennies were produced, but only a few have the potential to be worth a fortune. Back in 1970, the U.S. Mint in Denver produced these pennies, but due to a few rare errors and variations, some pennies from this batch are now incredibly valuable. One such variation is the famous small date versus large date error. The small date pennies have a noticeably smaller, and more delicate date compared to the large date pennies. Collectors are always on the lookout for these variations. But that's not all. Condition plays a huge role too. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with higher grades indicating better condition. A 1970D penny in pristine condition, especially one with a small date variation, can be worth a significant amount of money. In fact, some of these pennies have been sold at auctions for thousands, even millions of dollars. It's all about rarity, demand, and the right buyer. So, how can you tell if you have one of these rare pennies? Grab a magnifying glass and look closely at the date and mint mark. Compare it with images of known small date pennies. If you think you have one, it might be worth getting it professionally graded. Remember, coin collecting is not just about the potential financial reward. It's also about the history and the thrill of the hunt. So, check your piggy banks, old jars, and coin collections. You never know, you might just find a 1970 D penny worth millions. Thanks for watching! Don't forget to like, subscribe, 
and hit that notification bell for more exciting coin discoveries. Leave a comment if you found any interesting coins or if you have questions. Happy hunting! As video, we're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting. Imagine finding a 1977 Lincoln penny that's worth a million dollars. Sounds too good to be true. Well, let's find out. The Lincoln penny, also known as the Lincoln cent, has been a staple in American currency since 1909. While most pennies are worth only one cent, some rare coins can fetch a hefty sum. But what makes a 1977 Lincoln penny worth so much? First, let's talk about what makes a coin valuable. Factors include rarity, condition, historical significance, and unique errors or variations. In the case of the 1977 Lincoln penny, collectors are particularly interested in mint marks and any potential errors. Mint marks indicate where a coin was produced. The main U.S. mint facilities are in Philadelphia, no mint mark, Denver, D, San Francisco, S, and West Point, W. For the 1977 Lincoln penny, the most common mint marks are D for Denver and no mint mark for Philadelphia. Now, let's talk about grading. The condition of a coin significantly impacts its value. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a perfect, flawless coin. A 1977 Lincoln penny in mint condition, with no signs of wear and tear, can already be worth more than its face value. But what about those million-dollar pennies? These are usually coins with rare errors. For example, misprints, double dies, or other minting mistakes. Such errors can make a coin incredibly valuable to collectors. If you think you have a valuable 1977 Lincoln penny, here are a few steps to take. First, inspect the coin for any unusual features or mint errors. Next, check the coin's condition. Then, Get it professionally graded by a reputable grading service like PCGS or NGC. Once your coin is graded, you can determine its value more accurately. You might even want to consult a professional appraiser or auction house if you think you have a rare find. Remember, while the chances of finding a million-dollar penny are slim, coin collecting is a fun and rewarding hobby. Who knows? You might just strike it rich. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating stories from the world of coin collecting. Hit that bell icon to get notified whenever we post new content. And let us know in the comments if you have any interesting coin finds or stories. We've got an incredible story that will make you want to check your change immediately. We're talking about a 1981 mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth, drumroll please, millions of dollars. That's right. This seemingly ordinary penny could be your ticket to fortune. But what makes this particular coin so valuable? Let's dive into the fascinating world of coin collecting and uncover the secrets behind the million-dollar 1981 mint Mark Lincoln penny. First, a little history. The Lincoln penny, designed by Victor David Brenner, has been a staple of American currency since 1909. The 1981 penny is part of this long-standing tradition but not all 1981 pennies are created equal. So, what sets the million-dollar penny apart? The answer lies in the mint mark and a rare error. In 1981, pennies were minted in Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. But the real treasure is an extremely rare mint error that occurred during the production process. Some 1981 pennies were struck with a double die. This means that during the minting process, the coin was struck twice resulting in doubled images on the coin. Look closely at Liberty or the date 1981. If you see doubling, you might have a rare and valuable coin. But don't just take my word for it. I took this penny to a professional coin appraiser to get an expert opinion. Doubling errors like this are extremely rare and highly sought after by collectors. Depending on the condition of the coin, it could be worth anywhere from thousands to even millions of dollars. Isn't that amazing? A single penny could change your life. So, how can you find out if you have one of these rare coins? First, grab a magnifying glass or a jeweler's loop and carefully inspect any 1981 pennies you have. Look for any signs of doubling on the letters and numbers. If you think you have a rare penny, consider getting it professionally graded and appraised. That's it for today's video. 
If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of rare coins, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to your channel name, and turn on notifications so you never miss an exciting episode. And who knows? Maybe you have a million dollar penny hiding in your pocket right now. Thanks for watching, and happy hunting! We've got an exciting episode lined up for you. We're talking about a 1982 Lincoln penny that could be worth millions. Yes, you heard that right. So, grab your magnifying glasses and let's dive in. First, let's talk a bit about the history of the 1982 Lincoln penny. This was a significant year for the U.S. Mint because it was the year they transitioned from copper to a zinc composition. Before 1982, pennies were made of 95% copper. However, due to rising copper prices, the Mint decided to switch to a cheaper zinc core with a thin copper coating. This means that in 1982, there were both copper and zinc pennies minted, and there are even seven different varieties from that year. But what makes a 1982 penny worth potentially millions? It all comes down to a rare mint mark error. In 1982, the Philadelphia Mint produced pennies without a mint mark, while the Denver Mint produced pennies with a D-mint mark. However, there have been reports of 1982 pennies with a small D-mint mark that appears to be an error. These error pennies are incredibly rare and highly sought after by collectors. Now, let's talk about value. A regular 1982 penny might only be worth its face value, but if you find one of these rare error pennies, you're looking at a potential gold mine. Some of these rare 1982 error pennies have sold at auction for over a million dollars. The key is to get your coin authenticated by a professional grading service. They can confirm if your penny is the real deal. So, how can you tell if you have one of these valuable pennies? First, you'll need a magnifying glass or a jeweler's loop. Look closely at the mint mark. If you see a small D that looks out of place or faint, you might have an error penny. Additionally, weigh your penny. A copper penny will weigh about 3.11 grams while a zinc penny will weigh about 2.5 grams. Make sure to check every 1982 penny you come across. You never know when you might strike it rich. Well, that's it for today's episode of Coin Treasures. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting coin discoveries. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Who knows? The next penny you find could be worth a fortune. We have an exciting topic that's sure to grab your attention. Imagine owning a coin that's worth millions of dollars. Sounds too good to be true. Well, stick around, because we're diving into the fascinating world of the 1985 Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Could this little coin in your pocket make you a millionaire? Let's find out. The 1985 Lincoln Penny might seem like just another common coin at first glance. But as with many collectibles, Rarity and unique features can make all the difference. What makes some 1985 pennies potentially worth a fortune? First, let's take a quick look at the history of the Lincoln penny. Introduced in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth, this coin has seen many changes over the decades, including variations in mint marks and compositions. Mint marks play a crucial role in determining a coin's value. For the 1985 Lincoln penny, most were produced at the Philadelphia and Denver mints. However, some rare variations and errors have emerged over time, making certain coins highly sought after by collectors. So, what should you look for in your 1985 pennies? Here are a few key features that can significantly increase their value. Recently, some 1985 Lincoln pennies with rare minting errors have been sold for impressive sums at auctions. These coins are often found by sharp-eyed collectors who know what to look for. Websites like PCGS, NGC, and Cointracker offer valuable resources for identifying and valuing coins. Joining online forums and collector communities can also provide insights and advice from fellow enthusiasts. Remember, while the chances of finding a million-dollar penny are slim, the thrill of the hunt and the potential for discovery make coin collecting a rewarding hobby. Who knows? You might just get lucky. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exciting content about rare coins and collectibles. 
and if you have any interesting finds or stories, drop them in the comments below. Happy hunting, and I'll see you in the next video. We have an intriguing topic, the 1993 D. Lincoln Penny, and why some people believe it could be worth millions of dollars. The 1993 D. Lincoln Penny might look like any other penny at first glance. It's small, copper-coated, and bears the familiar face of Abraham Lincoln. But there's more to this little coin than meets the eye. So, what makes a coin like this potentially worth so much? Let's dive into a few key factors that can drastically influence a coin's value. First up, we have rarity. While millions of 1993 D pennies were minted, certain errors or variations can make a specific coin extremely rare. Minting errors like double strikes, off-centers, or unique die flaws can catch the eye of collectors. Errors occur when something goes wrong during the minting process. For example, a double strike means the coin was struck twice, resulting in a blurry or doubled image. These errors are rare and can make the coin much more valuable. Another factor is the coin's condition, known as its grade. Coins are graded on a scale from poor P1 to perfect mint state, MS70. The higher the grade, the more valuable the coin. For a penny like the 1993 D, finding one in pristine condition is exceptionally rare. Collectors look for coins with minimal wear, clear details, and no damage. A 1993 D penny in mint state could fetch a high price at auction, especially if it's an error coin. A 1993 D Lincoln penny with a unique error, in top notch condition, can indeed sell for thousands or even millions at auctions as collectors and investors look to own a piece of numismatic history. So, if you come across a 1993 D penny, take a closer look. You might just have a hidden treasure in your pocket change. Make sure to get it appraised by a professional to understand its true value. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment if you have any questions or interesting coin finds and don't forget to subscribe for more coin collecting tips and treasures.